question 17. Well, this question is all about the area of a trapezium, and we're given that formula at the front of the paper. So the area of a trapezium is half the two parallel sides added together, multiplied by the distance between the two. So applying that, that to this question is half of the two parallel sides added together, so the x plus 7 and the x, and then that's multiplied by that uh, perpendicular height, which is 2x, and we're told that that area equals 17. So we've basically constructed our own equation, which we need to solve. So start off by adding up within inside the square brackets, x plus 7 plus x is 2x plus 7. So we've now got three terms being multiplied together. Well, half times 2 is 1, so that simplifies down to that. Uh, multiply out the bracket by the claw, minus 17 from both sides, and we get the quadratic equation we were asked to show. Now, for part B, we can just completely start again. All right, We've now just got to solve this. Now, the clue to the method is in the wording of the question. Correct to three significant figures. That suggests we're going into decimals, so we're not going to be able to factorise it. We're going to have to use the quadratic equation, which again is given. A is the number in front of the x squared, so that's 2. B is the number in front of x, which is 7. And C is the coefficient on the end, the minus 17. So just substituting that into the formula, we get this. Now, remember, it's plus or minus, but we need to have a, um, a plus for the x value, because obviously x is a length, it can't be minus. So we can discount the minus option. So it's minus 7 plus the square root of 185 over 4 which is 1.6503, rounding to 1.65 to 3 sig figs.